What time is it, you say? Why, it's time for the Spelunky Daily Challenge with Brian. I did a warm-up run before this, as I usually do, and I did not bad. I got to the jungle, uh, but I was still taking damage in a couple of foolish ways. I'm still sufficiently, I don't know, sufficiently out of practice? Is that even like a reasonable phrase to, to utter? Uh, but yeah, I still feel like there's a lot of fundamentals that I need to kind of get back into, you know, having, doing well in my game. Alright, I need to be careful about this TNT, but there's nothing that's gonna, like, spray some blood over here. So I should be able to rescue the dog. It's the daily challenge, so I'm definitely gonna get these bits of gold and rubies as well. And then carefully find my way back out. It's a bit of gold and things up there, but it didn't seem particularly accessible. And... Let's see, what do we got down here? All right, the bat, I can just throw the dog at you. Not a problem. And looks like we're just gonna continue quickly towards the exit over here. We'll go ahead and let the dog out. Who let the dogs out? Well, at least for the first damsel doggy, it was me. It was Brian. Oh, that was a dumb thing. There could have been a monster inside there. I got lucky. Really gotta be careful of pots. Uh, let's see. There could be a fair amount more money over there. But rather than spend resources, well, we're still pretty, I got through this pretty quickly. Let's spend a rope. Ropes are not nearly as valuable as bombs, and it does seem like there's a fair bit more money over here, potentially. Yes, indeed. Oh, and there was a, there was a box up there, too. I might be able to get up to that. Uh, I'm going to set the rock down real quick while I open this up. Just some tiny bits of gems. I have to be careful of the TNT. As we take this guy out, and... I guess I can push that over there just to make an easy way to get over here. I think that's good enough. I don't see any obvious other money lying around. And with that, yeah, I don't know that I'm going to be able to get that crate very easily. If I set a bomb here, would that open things up? Actually, let's take a risk. I'm not sure when you don't have pasty bombs exactly how that will behave. But possibly from here. Yes, I can get up here. Okay, great. Ooh, a machete. That is a... I don't know that I've ever gotten a machete inside the Daily Challenge before. So that's kind of exciting. We will go ahead and happily take that forward. Into the next level. This this could be good. I need to make sure I don't accidentally smack the dog with it. I'm not accustomed to wielding the machete very often in this game. Alright, just a tiny bit of money over here. There's a shop down here. Let's take a quick look before we head across. Spike boots, climbing gloves, that's not bad, and I could rob it because the the ice gun or whatever is in there. And so since it is the daily challenge, although I've already got the machete, I could also just kill the shopkeeper with the machete, which is easier to do. I don't have tons of practice with either of them. I think the ice gun is actually smarter. Actually, let's do this. Let's go ahead and set that off. I'll leave the machete down there. That's kind of a just-in-case, but I'm pretty sure I can gently pick this up, lure him out here, and then do this! Yes, to destroy him and then pick up these other objects, and now I would prefer to have the shotgun. Alright, and now we are a shotgun-wielding Spelunky Monkey. So that is fantastic. I've also got the climbing gloves. There's a dog over here. I don't have many bombs. <sighs> I don't have many bombs. And I'm not sure that one bomb is going to successfully open this up. And so... Not sure if it's a good idea or not, but I'm going to preserve my bombs. Actually, if I use the climbing... Yeah, I'm going to preserve my bombs for right now. And not worry about rescuing the dog. I do have five hearts. And we won't encounter another shopkeeper until the next level, at least. I do see the exit down there, but let's take a look around for... Ooh! Where did this shopkeeper's body go? I want to sacrifice him. Uh, did I leave him up there? No, his body's gone because of, uh, I blew it up with the whatever. Right. That's a shame. Alright, I may be able to get paced. I'm not great at fighting these big spiders. But I do have a shotgun. And so, oh, but there's spikes over there. I need to be careful. You know what? I was just talking about not having many bombs, but I'm gonna do- oh crap! Alright, that worked out kind of okay. Spent more resources than I wanted to. Uh, but 
I do have pace now as well, and let's see. I'm gonna set down the shotgun real quick just to quickly open this pot. All right, tiny bit of gold there. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> I haven't done well in the previous couple of daily challenges, and so I think I'm gonna try to be careful at the expense of not getting everything that I could get in the hopes that instead I will stay alive and get further on. Okay, so there's a shopkeeper down here and we've angered the shopkeepers, so... Ooh, and he's got good stuff. He's got lots of bombs. All right, so we're gonna be happy about that. Let's go ahead and open that up. Just in case that skeleton happens to be alive. We also killed, looks like a, whoop, not a spitting cobra. The spitting cobra is up there and he's still spitting, so let's be careful. All right, we got the, what do you call here? I think I can drop this down here, yes. So let's, I'm gonna miss one little bit of gold there, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and carry this on down. Can even use it to set off the trap down there. And I get the, I can just jump on this guy's head. And then, all right, we're gonna have a shopkeeper over to the right, and so I need to be careful. Not sure exactly how far over he is. But we're probably getting close. Let's see. Right, there he is. He's right there. He still doesn't see me. I definitely want all the stuff in the shop, though, so I'm gonna take a risk. Oh, crap, he got a hit on me. Crap, 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 crap! I dropped my shotgun! Do, 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 do! I ended up climbing down the wall rather than jumping down to shoot him. <sighs> Alright, I still need a lot of practice in this game, apparently. And... Is the network down? I can't seem to read the leaderboards. Well, I know that I'm not going to do very well in this one. I feel like, just having seen a couple of the uh, top levels, that uh, this is going to be one that some people will do very well at. Uh, I don't know, I just got a sense off of the first two levels of what I saw. So we'll see what other people do on this challenge. I'll try to remember tomorrow to come back and take a look at how people did. I hope that you guys are having a great day, and I will see you again soon with more Spelunky.